a very interesting stream. And it's very interesting because of the fact that my FPS counter on this thing is broken as fuck because apparently it says I'm going at 180 frames per second. Um... <laughs> I didn't even know games could reach that. That's, um... Wow! <laughs> Holy shit, I've never seen such high FPS in my life and good, I'm glad audio is good. Um... So the entire premise of this game is very... Interesting to say the least. Um, first of all, it doesn't look like you can actually. Oh wait, you can. Whoops. Well, I didn't realize that. Seems like we're okay though, honestly. For the most part. Okay. Yes. Save. Looks like for the most part we're okay. Let me just quickly um change my key bindings here. I didn't actually see this when I came into the game. Whoopsie. But the premise of this game is very interesting in that. It's taking place in a... Um, actually, you're a bit loud. Um, just a little bit. Let's see if I can... Do that a little bit. Do I sound a little better? Anyway, though. The whole premise of this game is essentially... You are a video game character in a world that is not yet complete in its development cycle. So there's going to be some really interesting dialogue between... Um... A lot better? Good. Glad. But um, there's going to be some interesting dialogue between the developers and the story writers. and It's, it's just going to be pretty damn cool. So that'll be enjoyable. Throw pick up. Let's do... Um, let's do shift. No, let's not do shift. Let's do bat space. Sure. Map will leave as M. Fill, blah, blah, blah. Summon allies. So just hold those. Okay. Edit. We'll do... Yeah, we'll leave that as E. Target ally, Q, let's do T, inventory I, change quick tab. Alright, we're gone. Or we're done, yeah. So, yeah, sorry I didn't do that prior to. I didn't realize it was even possible to do prior to. Um, we're gonna turn down this stuff because, you know, I don't want the game to be too bad. If it's too quiet, obviously I can turn it back up, but, you know, when the game gets going, I don't want it to be louder than me. But just in case, I'll turn on subtitles as well. Good thing they have it. So, yeah. And the reason I'm doing this game, honestly, this game does not have enough fucking, um... This game does not have enough attention. It is very well done. It's, pr it's pretty pricey. It's like 19 bots, which is unfortunate. But it's really a rather, or yeah, a rather well-made game. So, without further ado, let's just start. Enjoy. My old man used to take off his wedding ring and sort of flick it into a spin. I remember being scared to blink, like, what if he loses it? Would he lose mom? Would he lose me? So, that's our cold open. Just a ring, twirling over black. Will it stand or fall? And then, as Starfather, I speak. Once, Starfather stood alone before the circle. Within it, he placed everything. First breath, final gasp, love, loathing, you. By his will, circle became ring. By his hand, earth parted from sky. But even he could not foresee the coming of Ava Nadir. Okay, I'm trying to record here, and you're making that face again. The player can skip this, right? <laughs> oh, yes. The story is only my life's work, but by all means, skip to the last page. Shall I leave it blank, so you have somewhere to doodle? Ish, you were married, right? You and your wife ever dress up? You know, role play? Maze. Thought so. And in that little scene, did you all find yourselves in burning need of a narrator? No. The meaning lives and dies in the act. Someone's never been in love. It's <clears throat> just a game. Shut up and let them play. Ah, uh, people, just use this take for now. I'll redo it tomorrow. Uh, we end on Through the Ring, and fade up as the hero awakens. So this is the actual game. Um, so as you've seen already, the dialogue is going to be quite interesting, and the art style is quite nice, but it's only going to get better, trust me. This is an amazing... It really is just an amazing game. And okay, I heard what you said, Jason. That's unfortunate. Oh no. Nah, yeah, it's not updating faster. 
But, um... Yeah. This is the world. Really dark and fucked up. There's a giant hand out there. I want to go over to it really badly, but I can't. I can't. Which is unfortunate. There's smoke and shit. This village has been burned, but by what kind of scenario here? Everything's in black and white. You know, it's, this is probably going to be a really dark game, right? Oof. Some fucked up things like that, though they're untextured, which is a little awkward. Tate's sword. Swad. Mom, father's sword? Hero, my father. No, fa what? Oh, a sword! Hold, please. What? So, who are you? <laughs> a new playtester? What? Let me save you some time. Today, I push the buttons. <laughs> we are not changing this part again. Twenty years, Maze. Twenty years I've wasted writing about the almighty player. <laughs> But who is the player this is anyway? Scary. They're like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Genocide. They demand a world full of deep, compelling characters, yet at any time, they reserve the right to turn said people As a writer, piles of gently glowing eyes. I agree with everything Ish is kind of saying here. What story could survive these conditions? It's a murder mystery now? Hmm. Everyone's dead. Who could do such a thing? Oh yeah, me. Look! Look at our hero. A lonely mute who can't even lower their killing hand. Matricide is just how they say hi. Your story needs mom to live, so I have to cut all weapons out of the game? Negative. Fire me. Never. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Long story. No choice. No! Oh, come on! So yeah, this is the this is kind of the situation in which um, that was kind of a, a reference to storyboard artist versus gameplay designer. Next. So that's nice. This is what I meant by it's in game development. It's a really cool concept, really. May shall we continue? Now we don't have any animations yet, but I can make do. Here. It reminds me of Wreck-It Ralph, but video game, and not famous people. She alone now commands life and death. Yeah. Something, something. Ish. The company is broke. The last kickbacker campaign raised less money than that joke fund demanding <laughs> to have you cane by the state. <laughs> She's so realistic. Fire. Even now, I struggle to hold the sky aloft. Never proven. Point is, we can't raise a penny more without a live gameplay demo. Yes, I'm writing the demo script as we speak. Wit must be your soul. And virtue, your, your soul. <laughs> now go, hero. Take back the circle. Whoosh! <laughs> Whoosh! Away he goes. Sure, why not? Hello. Return. It's just a non-textured object with a bunch of weird portals around it. Sure. Eric, lead level I'm designer. For a boss fight. Scape, I don't know which of your artists did it, but putting the elementary lock way, way above the door means that like 110% of the tests are just spinning in place, clutching the keys, looking for a hole, and cursing the game's designers. I have news for you. All the glorious detail you put in the treetops, vaulted ceilings, not a mortal soul has ever seen them. Repeat after me. The player never, ever looks up. Fits it. Looked up. I looked up. <laughs> uh, it is kind of true. No one really does look up. I'm like one of the few that does in most video games. Anyway, though, where no, do we go? Not quite right. Where are we? Portals? Portal. Temp. Cloud Ram Quest. That's incomplete for now. Just cheat and spawn air key. Oh. Well, okay. Carried objects can be thrown. Hold bat space to aim your throw to release the throw. Okay. <laughs> The door! <laughs> yeah, makes a game about looking up. That'd be interesting. <clears throat> Temp, Ice Peach Quest. Status, incomplete. Same deal. Spawn Ice Team. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Alright, that's two. I've been for such a perilous journey. We're almost done, guys. Almost done. 
Temp. Volcano quest. Status incomplete. Same deal. Spawn fire tea. Okay. There we go. Alright. Alright, we got this. Life jungle quest. Incomplete. Same deal. Spawn life tea. There we go. See? We've done it. We fought through thousands of bosses. Thousands of enemies. And now we beat the game. Oh, the gate. It has opened. What possible mysteries may lie beyond? And then, eight to twelve hours later, <laughs> I am Ava Nadir. Hey, what are you? Then we release the Hellhounds. Hellhounds. Oh, wait. But we just cut combat. So, um. We? Oh no. I'm deleting the end game bridge so the team knows we're blocked by your decision. What? I want to ship this thing. That's the contract I signed. You stole ten years of my life. We don't own you. Just the rights to your celebrity name and face. And if you quit, I use it like so. Damn. My real name is Maze Evelyn. Once I was a hotshot pro gamer, but now I teach yoga. <laughs> I'm also legally married to a crystal. <laughs> You're holding my brand hostage? Okay, ish. Okay. I'll stay on until the demo, but wait till I tell you my new idea for the end game. Threats don't sink in anymore, Maze. Try reading some of my fan mail. <laughs> now I need to review the final cinematic. Alone. Thank you. Nadir! I have waited so long to face you! Hero, you are trapped! My minions will destroy you! Uh oh. But. But there's no combat. Ah! Run! Ah! Yeah. I designed that fight to be hard, not unwinnable. But with no weapons, it might as well be a. Ugh. Cutscene. Thanks, Ish. But there's a bug. Fixed. Your body was erased, but it hangs around, taking up memory. <laughs> so move if you want to finish testing. Good. Good. I can ghost for everything. Yes. Yes. We're going into the, the thing. Oh, dear God. We're breaking the fucking third wall here, people. We're going in somewhere. Holy shit. Look at this fucking scenery. Okay, this should be interesting. This should be very interesting. Come on. How far is this thing? I guess breaking the fourth wall isn't that easy, I suppose. It made sense. And we're in. To rewrite this too. Something like even weaponless, the champion the live review. May dear. For they had selflessly offered up their firstborn son to Star Father. To become a new god. I like it. Ah, the fuck hello. are you? Uh, Coda, right? Mesa's community intern. Why are you here? Love, sir. What? Your work is the great love of my life. Coda. Don't panic. I won't ask you to sign any body parts. But I have literally grown up waiting for the sequel, and I will help finish it. Did you rehearse this? <laughs> Many times, but hear me out. It might interest you to know that you make video games for a living. That should be an act of love. But after 20 years, well, love is not some mystic, inexhaustible force. It's a fuel. Projects like this run on it. And sir, Look at all these your, meals. your tank is dry. You think I sound young, but purpose trumps experience and you know it. This upcoming demo, <laughs> I won't sleep until it's perfect. The magic circle has come too far to run empty now. It will reach everyone. And if necessary, sir, I'll burn for it. Wow. Coda, ignore whatever Maze told you. Now you're hired. Is it? Is it over? Uh, it would seem it's over. What? Yes. You're thinking, that's it? Did I miss the punchline? You're right, boss. This world is a joke. And I need you to finish it. See, that was only the beginning. Now, now everything changes. Prepare to have your mind blown. Yeah. We're going in, 